This channel is supported by Truefire. Truefire is an online library of lessons from some of my favorite players. There's thousands of lessons on there. You can use the promo code JNC40 to get 40% off of any of their courses. So aside from the uh, Grammatico GSG, which I did a video on uh, yesterday, I think, depending on whenever I upload this video, there's this Line 6 Elmsley amp, which I think is notable for sounding awesome. That's what I was using in the introduction there. Um, takes pedals really well, but also just sounds and feels. Sam, who works uh, at Line 6, this is his first amp, I believe, uh, that he's worked on by himself. Uh, I think he's done a really good job. I've got the drive here at 7.1, bass, mid, and treble at 5, uh, just a, a good starting point. Presence and depth at 5. Obviously, tweak from here to, to get what you're looking for, but this is an important control here, the negative feedback. As you increase that... <laughs> get this thinner sound for the more open stuff. Uh, just sounds great. I like it all the way off. Uh, depth will be your kind of low end stuff. I think if you have negative feedback off, these controls make less. Of a difference, because it's uh, power amp stuff, isn't it? Anyway. So I then also paired a, a tube screamer with it. Another choice that is new here, and I think this is my favorite fuzz within the Helix now, is the Dark Dove fuzz based on a Russian Big Mark.
just has this really nice kind of dark but sustaining. <laughs> To me, that's exactly what I would want out of a fuzz pedal, but it's so rarely the sort of thing I actually get out of a fuzz pedal that I tend to not go for fuzzes. Um, but this is just perfect, sustaining, feels amazing. <laughs> just works incredibly well. Um, another thing that is worthy of note here, I think there's a new rotary thing, but there's also these new cabs. So this open cast is an open back 1x12 with an EVM speaker. <laughs> You know, we should call this the Mayor update because it's, you know, not only a Dumble style amp, but there's also this EVM style speaker, which a bunch of the Dumble users, I think Howard Dumble himself, his favourite speaker to pair with it was, in fact, the EVM. And then Mayor's favourite speaker here, the 65 Celestian. <laughs> bit more mid-rangey um, but Robin Ford as well used these speakers uh, and so you know if you're looking for those kind of classic dumbly tones it's this type of speaker that is used in two rock amps as well I think they have like a rebadge 65 <laughs> Let's just go both open cream. Consider, you know, experimenting with these. Um, and also, we've now got the new cab versions of both of the matchless speakers. That's something I'm really happy about as well. Also the silver bell and blue bell which sound incredible too. But this Elmsley amp just seems to really sound great to me. Just a really, really wonderful short little update. That is, uh, there's also a rotary speaker and the Aguilar uh, tone hammer bass amp. But I'm thinking some of these cabs, I'm definitely going to be using a load, and I'm definitely going to be using the Elmsley, and 100% obviously I'm going to be using the Dumble, and obviously this <laughs> fuzz pedal just sounds great. <laughs> just a, a really great update from line six so i'm i'm hugely thankful for the work they've done on this cheers line six <laughs>